The White House released a skinny version of its budget proposal for 2026 today, including all federal agencies. This budget proposes cutting NASA's funding by 25% from $25 billion to $18.8 billion. Some major legacy programs on the chopping block include SLS, Orion, and the Lunar Gateway, which are set to be phased out after Artemis III. The budget cites SLS's $4 billion per launch cost and 140% budget overrun as reasons to move to cheaper commercial systems. The Mars Sample Return Mission also cancelled. The ISS is also getting dialed back with fewer crew, fewer flights, and reduced research capacity. Instead, the U.S. administration wants to focus on human space exploration and beat China to the moon and Mars. They're allocating over $7 billion for lunar and $1 billion for Mars efforts, a chunk of which will likely be given to SpaceX, according to Ars Technica senior space editor Eric what? Berger. No way. What? what? No. That's not going to happen. They're not going to give most of it to SpaceX almost by default. No. Oh, there's Boeing. How could you say? Oh, totally. Yeah. They're in the running for sure. Wow. No one saw this coming a hundred days ago. Okay. Well, I guess that's all you have to say about that. Not really. I like, so uh, bit of a, bit of a NASA fanboy here. Um, so he just watched his team take a massive L by the way, people are freaking out about this. Well, yeah. On those teams. Well, yeah. A 25% cut means a lot of people are losing jobs. And I've heard, I don't know the legitimacy of this. I've heard, but you can do better science with three quarters as many people, right? Yeah, It'll I mean, that's a, that's a big part of that. I don't know if that was in here, but uh, a lot of that funding reduction was just science. And like, if you, if you look at a lot of American innovation over the years, like NASA has driven a lot of it, like, a, like actually quite a bit, um, cordless drills, NASA. Like uh, there, there's, there's, there's tons of stuff that you wouldn't really think about cordless power tools in general, as far as my understanding goes. Um, and, and they're, they're massively reducing their, their science budget, both, um, like, uh, space and not, uh, Velcro memory foam. People are just listening to this stuff. Yeah. Like it's, this is a big deal for like innovation in the States. Um, well in the world really. I mean, yeah. I use cordless tools too. I don't live in America. Yeah. Like it's, it's, um, it's rough. It's not just like a, a lot of the writing when you look at like, oh, why are they doing this? Um, SLS being really expensive, which like, yeah, I mean, it's way over budget and it's really expensive. Okay. I'm not really <laughs> going to try to fight that too much. Um, I do have some concerns about moving all of your ability to get to space into commercial hands. I don't know how cool that is. Well, they always well prioritize safety out. over everything else. Right? Right? Like, commercial I just, entities. <laughs> It's, uh, it makes me a little uncomfortable. I don't know if that's the right move, but it is, it is, yeah, it is way over budget, all that kind of stuff. But like canceling the Mars sample return mission and being like, oh, humans will just do it. Like, wow, that's really bold. Um, Unique it would be username cool, says that's just stuff that would have been invented by others anyway. But it's like by that, by that <sighs> logic, why invent anything ever? Because someone's going to invent it at some point. Someone else will do it. Why don't we just wait? Yeah. Do you need your computer? Like. It doesn't matter if someone invented it, you know, decades ago. You could have just waited for someone else to do it. By the way, NASA advancements have helped computer stuff a lot. Um, anyways, yeah, it's just I, I think the the impacts of this are a lot more wide reaching than people immediately realize. Um, well, that's because I mean we've talked about this on the show before, regardless of the political leanings. Um, there is a serious problem with short administration terms incentivizing extremely short-term actions and short-term thinking um and it's 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 a real problem because a lot of the time what is done is not really felt by the general consumer until much 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 later and when you when you go at sort of you know scientific cradles of innovation like nasa um you might not feel it for Never mind like four years or eight years, right? Which would be your your one or two term presidency, right? You might not feel that for twenty five years. Like 
trying to think off the top of my head of uh, like an older NASA innovation that uh, there was, man, there was something that was in the news recently that was like, yeah, they, they were looking at this. It was, I don't know if it was um, NASA, if it was one of the other big like national labs, uh, but they were looking at this like, like years and years and years ago, decades ago. And like, finally we were like, oh, whoa, here's an application to this. I, I'm sorry. I can't remember it off the top of my head, but there, there have been examples where it's not necessarily clear uh, what the commercial application of this will be. Um, but the work that's being done is still extremely important. What are we looking at here? Things that wouldn't have been possible without space travel. Oh yeah, cool. Camera phones, crash resistant lenses, CAT scans, LEDs, landmine removal, athletic shoes, foil blankets, water purification system, dust busters, ear thermometers, home insulation, the jaws of life, wireless headphones, memory foam, freeze dried food, adjustable smoke detectors, baby formula, artificial limbs, computer mouse, uh, portable computers. I don't know if computer mice or portable computers are, are important to you guys at all. Um, I don't know who got that list. It's not conclusive. Uh, that was on some one random site that somebody in full plane shared. Um, don't forget the movie Apollo 13 starring Tom Hanks. True. Never would have gotten that without space travel. Good stuff. Good stuff. Important stuff. Um, but yeah, like the, the reason why I'm so into NASA isn't, isn't just cause like space stuff. Cool. Space stuff is cool. Super cool. Space stuff. Cool is objectively based, but that was NASA's <laughs> website. It didn't look like it to me. NASA has a fair bit of credibility. If it was NASA's website, I don't mind it. It so, was. Yeah. <laughs> what does it say at the top of the picture? One sec. Oh, whatever. I read something wrong. My bad. Uh, that was absolutely NASA's website. It's not conclusive though, so I don't. Mm, I don't know what's going on there. But anyways, um, it's it's because in a way it represents like human advancement. Like it's not just space travel. A lot of it is science. Well, yeah, it's a that lot whole of it thing is with the astronomy. one small step for mankind. Yeah, and all that one like giant it's, leap. It's for not. It. It's not just rocket cool, rocket go fast, space neat. It's like this is how we like grow. There's that whole thing of like every scientific discovery is this like tiny microscopic pimple on the circle of knowledge that humans have. And it's like yeah, but when you do that a lot, the circle grow bigger. This was a big part of Circle Grow Bigger. Like it's, I don't know. Um, it's rough. I WD40. don't. I think this is bad for the world. Um, it's also inspirational. Yeah, absolutely, hugely so. Um, Apparently not anymore. I mean, remember when we were kids? Kids wanted to be what was it? Doctors, astronauts, lawyers, astronauts, and firefighters, and heads of state. And now it's uh, influencer, TikToker. Yeah. Now they want to be you. Yeah. Being me is not that little, great. A little bit less so him. Yeah. Because they want to be bigger on the short form media. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. And they probably don't want to be And then they like start older. figuring out the money stuff and then they want to get on YouTube. Yeah. It's when they're a little older, they want to get on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I, I don't like that word. I prefer mature. Mm, mm. <laughs> nice. <laughs> 